Hey guys, it's been a while, but um, <coughs> I've got some new stuff. Just picked up a uh, couple of things off eBay. First thing in this package, which is packaged quite well, Super Sidekicks 2. Got this off eBay. Never seen these carts with the um, pictures that stuck to the top how to play, but quite happy. So that's my first thing. Super Sidekicks 2. MVS. Second thing. Super Sidekicks 3, the next glory. Again, it's got the instructions on there. Never seen this either. Or G rating, I don't know if that was genuine or what the go is, but that's that. So yeah, another MVS cart, another bit of packing stuck in the cart. So that's my second item. I bought those mainly because I um, don't have any sort of soccer games, so I thought I'd better buy them. Next item. Old NES Robocop 2. So that's Robocop 2 for the NES. Had a look at it on YouTube and it looks pretty cool, so thought I'd buy that. These are all pretty cheap. I think the MVS games are about $30 each, and I think Robocop is about $12. Next item. Classic this, I used to love this back in the day when N64 first came out. Turok, Dinosaur Hunter. If you haven't played it, it's sort of a um, first person sort of go around hunting dinosaurs. <laughs> Alright, next. We've got for the AES Fatal Fury Special. Fatal Fury Special for the AES. And it's the English version. So yeah, happy with that. Have a look inside. I don't think this one comes with instructions. So in here, just the cart. Fatal Fury Special. Great game this. Still got that smell. Don't know if any of you have Neo Geo uh, AES carts, they've got a certain smell about them and they seem to retain the smell for years. So, yeah, the carts and the art on these AES games is unbelievable. Right, I think that was about 43 bucks. All packaged well, we've got all the uh, rice poppies in here. Last but not least. Blue's Journey for the AES. Got this for the MVS. It's a cool little platform game. Nothing much to it, but um, again, it's the English version. It's a lot easier over here in Australia. That most things are uh, the Japanese versions, but quite happy when I get the um, English versions. And this here, if I'm not mistaken, came with instructions as well. So as usual, the massive big. AES carts, it's hard to tell, but if we get that, then get Turok, which, you know, N64s were quite big carts compared to some of the other systems, but nothing compared to these. So that, in the instruction menu on the plastic, still got the smell. Blue never allows invaders to destroy Ray Guy's nature.
Well right, guys, I'll upload this. It's been a while, but um, thanks for watching. It's another little pickup I got this week, which I had years ago for the um, Super Nintendo. Another nice game. I didn't pay much for this. Probably 12 bucks, 20 bucks. It's another little pickup I got this week, which I had years ago for the um, Super Nintendo. Another nice game. I didn't pay much for this. Probably 12 bucks, 20 bucks.